everybody. Welcome to the Oracle Fitness Center. My name is Stacy, and you are here for Core Express on a fantastic Monday afternoon. It's going to be dynamite. We're going to work everything from between the shoulders and the hips, front to back, side to side. We're going to get after it. Today, you need your mat and you need your exercise sliders. And you know, if you don't have your exercise sliders and you're on like a wood, linoleum, vinyl, tile floor, washcloths, towels are going to work well. If you're on a carpeted floor, paper plates can work well too. And those old furniture sliders are the exact same thing as these fancy exercise sliders. All right, today we're going to get started. We're going to try to get through four exercises today. I think some of them will move a little quicker, so we'll, we're going to get after it. Or we might just have some shorter reps because they might be a little more intense. How about that? First exercise. You're going to need your beautiful sliders. You're going to need both of them. They're going to be under your feet. You are going to start in that beautiful plank position. You can be down on a forearm for this one. You could be up in high plank. We are going to bring those shoulders over the wrist. We know what happens when we get a little too far back. Not in that beautiful technique. And from here, we're going to do one knee at a time for our exercise. It is going to be slower. You are going to keep those hips down. It is not supposed to be fast. It is not a mountain climber. We are really engaging through that anterior trunk, keeping everything else nice and stable while we're doing it to make that motion happen. Ready? Begin it, right knee in, back out. Left knee in, back out. Good, we got 10 of that. I want you to think about that tension you're creating in the front part of your trunk, in that front part of your core. It's like your cat or your dog is about to jump on you while you're sitting on the couch or laying in bed or a child. It is that level of tension, and then we're doing this other action as we're going through the, the exercise. It's the stability that we want to help create. Good. We got two more. Dynamite. Sometimes we do that with a knee tuck. It's a little bit different kind of an exercise, isn't it? That's still really getting that engagement happening, but uh, but uh, a little bit different type of a challenge. We are going to go to our boat, and then we're going back to the sliders. Boat's going to be either feet, toes touching the mat, feet elevated, legs extended. Okay, we're going to pulse or press the arms down at the same time. But I love this position. This is not our position. Here, shoulders over the hips. Ready? Find that position, little bit of a recline. Here we go, begin with that pulse. I got you on the clock for this one. Don't worry, I'll tell you when. You can have those toes touching. If you want that little bit of extra support, that's okay. That's a lot of hip flexion happening. Here we go for four, three, two, and one. Nice. Let's we'll grab our sliders. We're coming back. We are gonna do that arm reach with the slider this time. We're gonna stay on the knees. One under each hand. Okay, I'm gonna come out a little bit into a plank position. How about I be here? I'm trying to find a good camera angle and I'm not succeeding. Here we go. Okay. I can make this work. I'm gonna be in a little plank position in my kneeling plank position. And I'm gonna come out and back in. Out and back in. One on each side, one rep. I'm sorry, I didn't say that clear. 
When you bring that hand out, that's one rep. Other hand out, two. Okay, 10, 10 total. Ready? Plank it up and begin. Other arm is bending as you're extending. It might not go out very far. That's okay. Because we're all about maintaining this beautiful position and we're getting some good shoulder work at the same time. Here we go, here we go. One more on each side. Beautiful. That one's a little more intense, right? We're getting that nice reach. It's that combination of that overhead motion with that ability to, to stabilize our trunk. We do that all the time in our regular people lives. We're gonna do some tabletops to pikes. We're gonna start in tabletop position. I'm gonna shift my hips back. Try to keep that pike position. Come back to tabletop, shift it to pike. I don't really wanna be way far uh, with my shoulders over my wrist. We will be a little bit, but we don't wanna be Super leaning forward. Start it up. We got 10 and begin. That was a little too far of a lean, right? I'll get better. Here we go. Good, eyes up. Nice transition here. Big push. Get those hips all the way back up. Back to that start position. Nice. Here we go, three more. Good. Last one. And beautiful. Woo! All right. Grab those sliders, put them under your feet. It's gonna be lovely, putting our hands where our feet just were. <laughs> we got those individual knee tucks, one on each side equals one rep, not one on each side equals two reps. Here we go, ready, begin. Create that tension. Melt those shoulders away from the ears. Slow low it. Look for that full range of motion. Here you go. Nice work. Push that floor away. We got one more on each side. Beautiful. Bring it to boat. The boat ride to nowhere. In four, three, two, set it up. Pulse it nice and strong. There we go, I just fixed mine. Like there's somebody pulling a string from my chest. But I'm not letting that overarching happening happen. Here we go. Here we go. Nice work. Legs tight. Here we go for four, three, two, and one. Beautiful. Back to the sliders. One on each side equals two reps. There we go. Find that position. Get in your plank. Melt those shoulders away from the ears. Boom. Good. 
No twisties on this one. Don't let those hips twist. Lessen your range of motion if you feel like you're getting too much twist happening. Here we go, here we go. One more on each side. Big push. Good. Woo! Let's, we just voted. Now we're gonna tabletop the pike. Oh, heavens. My brain on a Monday. Helps if I uh, go in the right order that I wrote it in. Pushing up strong. Start in that tabletop. Adjust accordingly, right? Here we go. Strong, strong, strong. Good. Out of way. Full hand in contact with that mat. You got this. There you go. Nice work. Two more. Last one. Oh, wait. Yes, that was the last one. Oh, man. Bring it back to the top. Let's do it. Single knee tucks. Single leg knee tucks. Feel them for it. This is that intention with that movement. Not just driving those knees into the chest. Willy nilly. Some intention behind our movement. Set it up. Ready? Begin. Here you go, here you go. You got this. Drop those hips if you need to. Two more on each side. One more on each side. Lovely. Woo! Let's vote it. <clears throat> Bend it up. Ready. Begin. Nice pulse. Pulse with those arms like you're pushing down. Again, springs. Really intentional. Nice and tall through that spine. Here you go. Out of way, out of way. Here we go. For four, three, two, and done. Nice. Bring it back. Very, very wrist wrist dominant today. We'll do a couple happiness for our wrist or in our hands when we get done. Set it up. Here we go. Begin. Nice. Whatever range of motion, you can maintain that beautiful positioning. One more on each side. Lovely. Lovely. Love seeing the asymmetries in that exercise, right? It's just me? Okay. Starting that tabletop, adjust accordingly. 
right here. This is where we're finishing. Big push, big push. You got this. I mean, pushing that floor away, by the way. Here we go. Three more. Last one. Down back. Beautiful. Woo. All right, let's show the wrist a little love. With some gentle circles. So it can be hands clasped together gently. A little clockwise circle, a counterclockwise circle. Thanks, wrist. You did a great job today. It's nice because we do a lot in this flex position. We just did a lot today in an extended position. It's good. It's good to work the opposites. We can do a gentle flexion and a little gentle extension. I love this. I love this throughout the day. I love to be mindful of what, what the rest of our body is doing while we're doing this gentle stretch. Am I slumped? Am I sitting up tall? What am I feeling right now? That has been Core Express. You did a dynamite job. We did all kinds of fun stuff. Thank you so much for joining me. Caroline is coming in for some lovely yoga. We won't see you all next week because we'll be we'll have a holiday here at the facility. So we won't have anybody in teaching on Monday. But we'll see you all tomorrow for some low intensity strength. Thanks so much for joining. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye.